Good morning, everyone. It's been a minute since we've been on the water. We got uh, four today. Brian, we're on a charter with Brian of Fishhead Kayak Charters. We have Jeff to my left and Jay's joining us. And we're going to go up the river here. It is uh, Thursday. What's the date? 16th of February. 2023 it's about 730 60 some degrees and uh, the tide is outgoing it's gonna be flat today low tide is flat 0 0.0 by 1130 winds are gonna be southeast 5 to 10 and it'll be otherwise a pretty decent day Right now, no breeze and no seams are out. But like I said, yeah, it's been a while since uh, I've been out fishing. So it's good to be back. Good day to do it. Good people to fish with. And uh, let's see what's going on here. working our way up the river. Breeze picked up a little bit, which is good for the bugs. We've all been throwing soft plastic. Nothing so far. Just throwing as we move. Seen some mullet. So far, pleasant day. No bites. I'm gonna stop right here and try this hole I just went over. See if something stuck around as they passed. You can probably see I am uh, in a new kayak. Big rig is at home in the garage, and I'm now on a bona fide SS127. My first ride in one, and I have to tell you, I like it. Sit up nice and high. I stood right up in it first time without a problem it's not as uh, battleship-esque as that big rig is the paddle holder is a little bit further back because of the positioning of the gear track everything seems to be all right so far with regard to placement of tracks and holders and things like that. My GPS is further up. This one came with a cup holder, so why not use it? Put in a couple of Scotty rod holders. And to add gear tracks on the side for the anchor and the paddle holder. But it's uh, pretty stable. Not as wide as the big ring, but it might work. Well, Jay just got himself a trout. Trout! All right. That's the hole. Nice work. Jay put one in the bag. That hole produces. All right, well, there we go. Folks, one in the bag. Jay is uh, really his first time fishing saltwater inshore fishing first time fishing from a kayak in salt water too and uh, that's why we're with Brian today make sure Jay catches fish Ooh, man 
while standing in a bona fide, I noticed it's still a sail. That doesn't change, but the profile of the boat in the hull doesn't get, it's not affected by the wind as much as that big rig. I kind of appreciate that. Kind of appreciate that. And it's stable. I mean, I get to wobble like that. Not as much as I do on the big rig. But I don't feel too wobbly. Try this shore right here. No one working that shoreline. Okay, we're going to try the uh, popping cork and Jerk bait on the net rig. Might as well. Throwing anything but everything but the gold spoon. Brian's doing the heavy dime. Jeff and Jay are on soft plastic. I was throwing the Yozuri. There we go. There we go. Feels like a trout. It's a nice one. Yeah. Sixteen. That's all right. I'm not a cheater. All right, guy. Sorry about this. Folks, I dispatch my fish right away. Easy peasy. Pull that down. Yeah, that was quick. Okay. Got another one. Oh, he's gone. He's gone. Never to bite again today. Well, just show you. you never know what the hell they're biting on.
That was a keeper as well. Well, they're in here. They're just a little further down. What's that? A little one? Yeah. You got to sing out, Jeff. You got to be proud. Fish on. Small one. Well, yeah, I think he's too small. Oh, come here, you. Sorry, buddy. Simmer down, simmer down, simmer down. He was right on the shore. All right, folks. <laughs> Stop and take a break on the way back to the launch. And uh, caught this little guy. Forgot to turn the camera on. But uh, they've been bugging my lure. Oh, jeez. Dude, stop. Stop, 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 stop. Sorry, little guy. Okay, that uh, last trout was at a quick stop on the way back to the launch. Like I said, we're cutting the day short. <clears throat> I have to get back. And some errands have to be done by three today, so only a half a day fished for uh, maybe four hours or on the water for hours I should say paddling fishing so I stopped at a favorite hole on the way back because you just can't pass it without taking a couple casts and it paid off at least for a small one and so now we're just going to I think paddle straight back I'll have to fight the urge to make casts in my normal spots but gotta get stuff done times things get in the way of fishing and you just have to deal with it so anyhow yeah we got about a mile and a half to get back we're going against the wind but with the tide so while it's not quite a wash the wind has a lot less effect than it would appear, at least from the video. It's blowing good enough. Could be. There was no wind, we could just ride the tide back, but not so. It's, I think the wind's stronger than predicted. Anyhow, uh, I think that's about it for the day.